Derek, how's it going? Hi guys. We're from Ignite YYC and we were hoping to ask you 43 questions, is that okay? I know who you guys are. <laughs> of course you can ask me some questions. All right. Who's your biggest inspiration? Uh, my aunt, I would say. What would people be surprised to know about you? Uh, they'd be surprised to know that I'm an event planner that doesn't drink. That is surprising. Yeah, don't tell anybody. <laughs> what is your favorite thing about Calgary? Uh, the people and the energy. The energy in the people, definitely. Love it. Best vacation? New York, for sure. Favorite emoji? Uh, the little kissy heart. God. Three material things you can't live without. Three material things I can't live without would be my chapstick, my cell phone, and my jeans. Hey, we're at Bridal Expo. Should we go take a walk? Yeah, sure. I'll, uh, I'll show you guys yeah, around a little bit. Sure. Follow me. Uh, cat or dog? Definitely dog. What is your favorite local restaurant? Right now, it'd be River Cafe. Guilty pleasure food? My guilty pleasure food is Ripple Old Dutch Chips with dill pickle dip. I could eat that stuff forever. You should trademark that. Best adjective to describe yourself? Uh, I would say dashing, because I'm always dashing from one place to another. Other than YYC, what is your favorite city in the world? New York City! <laughs> there we go. Guilty pleasure TV show? Downton Abbey. One thing that would make you get on an airplane tomorrow? New York City! <laughs> <laughs> what is your spirit animal? A, a dolphin. When are you at your best? I'm at my best when I'm doing something creative. When are you at your worst? When I haven't slept enough. Or if I'm hungry. Mm -hmm. That's my worst. Killer combination. Uh, what is your favorite song right now? Uh, anything by Odessa. Favorite song of all time? Anything by Fleetwood Mac. Vacation, beach or ski hill? Beach. Who would play you in a movie of your life? You know, I'm told that Guy Pierce would play me in a movie of my life. I don't see the resemblance, but that's what people that's say. That's a compliment, yeah. yeah. Um, who in the world would you take a bullet for? My mom. Guy style, ball cap or beanie? Definitely ball cap for guys. Girl style, Converse or Louboutins? Converse. Is there a blog that you follow closely? Yes, my own. I write it. Actually, the other blog that I follow really closely is James Altucher. I read everything that that guy writes on the internet. Well, what is your favorite dessert? Village ice cream right now. If you could have a superpower, what would it be? Uh, probably to fly, so it wouldn't take me so long to get from place to place. What is your idea of a perfect date? Uh, probably a nice meal in a nice restaurant with the handsome fella. What's the most dangerous thing you've ever done? I was a teenager for many years of my life. That was very dangerous. Who is the last person you texted? Uh, that would be my mom. What are you doing today? Uh, having dinner with my mom. <laughs> <laughs> Coming up a couple times. Oysters, East Coast or West Coast? West Coast and like the big fat ones. Yeah, ones yeah. That are like almost hard to eat. Here yeah. As the president of Boom Goes the Drum, what does your role entail? Uh, I spend a lot of time connecting things, people, dots. I'm a connector, I would say. What do you hope your clients feel when walking out of your office? Uh, inspired and relieved, usually. What is one of the biggest business setbacks you've ever faced? Uh, you know what, I don't know. I don't think I have, I don't believe in setbacks. I think everything contributes to a, uh, to a greater cause. So I, I, I sort of, I, I disregard that question. Sorry. No, that's, that's, <laughs> that's the way to look answer. at it. I like it. Could you list three adjectives that describe the vibe of Boom Goes the Drum? Yeah, fun, professional, and creative. What is your favorite thing about what you do? Uh, I think it's because I, my favorite thing about what I do is, uh, that I get to connect people with really special moments. I, I get to be a, a part of making some moments special for people in their lives. Is there any one event that you've planned which makes you particularly proud? Uh, yeah, definitely. The uh, Paul Hardy 10 year anniversary, that, that fashion show was, was a lot of fun. That was, a, that was definitely a special moment. Without Blank, my business would not be possible. Definitely my team, without my team. I don't think I'd be able to get dressed in the morning without my team. <laughs> if you weren't the president of Boom Goes the Drum, what would your ideal career be? I'd probably be a director, film director. <laughs> Is there a particular local charity in our city with which you work? Yeah, there's a couple. Uh, Contemporary Calgary, I work with 
in from the cold, and I work with the Cinderella project. Yeah, love it. Um, was there a turning point during your business endeavors where you stepped back and thought, wow, I've made it? Yeah, I think it was the moment that we won our first international award. That was a pretty big moment. That was, that was definitely a well. And lastly, as we make our way out, what is your advice to would-be entrepreneurs in our city? Uh, in the words of Shia LaBeouf, I would say, do it! <laughs> Thank you, Derek. It's been a pleasure. Thank you, guys. Thanks so okay. much. See, See you next This time. is the exit. All right, we're out. See ya.